girl, I'm in love with you, baby, and I want you to know. I was introduced to music in the third grade. My best friend, Chris Garland, who stayed behind me, actually played the trumpet. He was like three years older than me, but because of that, made me want to actually pursue music as well. We would rap um, on the street lights, you know, a battle and rap everything. It's a friend of mine um, that lives across the street from me named Anthony. He would rap a lot. A couple other guys. We'd go back and forth. It's just a thing to do. Nobody ever thought that it would actually be a career or, or that music would be this a backbone to how I live life and how I get through life. Keep talking. Okay. Talk to me. Okay. okay. All these bitches looking so fly. Yeah. Meeny, meeny, miny, motor, one I'm going by. The only reason you know I'm a writer is because I'm an artist. As a songwriter, you have to be selfless. You mm -hmm. evidently gave up the notion of an artist, period. You know, I'm a I'm an artist by default, mainly because there's nobody that actually does the type of music that I do as an mm -hmm. artist. But as a songwriter, I'm able to become these these people. You know, mostly most of the time. Um, being able to tap into the sensitive side of myself and yeah. become B and Rihanna yeah, and Mary yeah. and I make Rihanna be Rihanna more than anybody else. They can put number ones on all they want to. I know who Rihanna is. I know what she sounds like. I know what B sounds like. You wrote single ladies also. Mm -hmm. Put a ring on it. Yeah. What? Are you playing Love on Top over here? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the record that I did. Um it's it's, it's, it's quite unique because I actually get more joy out of watching somebody else succeed from something that I've either, either written or produced. I try to use myself as a vehicle to change where music is going versus where it is at this particular point on other artists. So, with your gift and that pen, I appreciate it, man. to think about it like not from an artist standpoint but a songwriter like we have to literally say this guy went and wrote this record we know the difference between the artist machine of dreams and then the machine of this is what has to happen because this is what he does you know there's an extra album because there's an extra album right we can do eight of them if we wanted to but we're gonna push this one in get whatever buzz out of it you know that we need to do and then they'll know the impact of when the machine hits and it's like Everywhere. The thing I wanted was a pyramid, basically in the same type of. Oh, in the same kind of style. Bingo. Okay. Got you. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, no. so, situated like right by It's crazy. I wanna your body, your body, I was faced with the reality to have a lot of logic and common sense about what I'm good at and what I'm not, and don't do anything that I'm not good at don't waste time doing that because I had already been taught that life is precious and can be gone within seconds so that's when that guy showed up the dream I want it to look like this so now that it's, it's very very tasteful and very high end like it's not what you would probably normally expect pretty simple and elegant basically kind of Victorian round and round up and down now. Round and round now. Up and down.